Somebody call the law. Somebody call the law. It got to be illegal for me to be so wrong. What up, though? Heist man, the foe talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions. Man, we is back at it once again. Pop the balloon to find love, episode 24. You know how we do, man. We judge people. Well, that's what I do, man. I like to judge people. Y'all can judge me, too. I'm going to judge them. Y'all getting judged. Everybody getting judged. We are all judges. So let's talk about people, man. That's what I like to do on here, man. I like to talk about people. Let's get right into it, man. Let's pop the balloon to find love, episode 24. We'll see what the business is this time, man. Here we go. Okay, they got dudes this time, I see. Be short. Let's get on them. Balls. No dead. Got the red shoes? Okay. Who that? Apollo? From, um... What you got the jeans on? Oh, Lord. Them shoes. Them bowling shoes? Oh, Lord. These dudes are crazy. Oh, you know he smoked. Is that shirt young? I left with the jeans on. like a fisherman what oh lord oh my god oh my god you fresh off work that shirt too big oh my god that, you, you, you. check out these deals of the week at walgreens all that for that belt he did all that for that belt come on walgreens let's get up out of here walgreens hello everyone and welcome back to my channel he did that to show his belt Arlette, off that big ass shirt another episode of pop the balloon or find love and we've got some single men lined up make some noise guys make sure i don't cough oh on God. camera this time <laughs> It was in okay, the comic section last okay, time. That's the energy you like. it, nigga, I so we'll be bringing out some single women one by Roll one. If she's your type, you like what you see, you like what you hear, do not pop your balloon. However, if there's anything you know she oh. says or anything on her you're not really feeling, we'll see these go females, ahead and pop man. Your balloon, we'll see and then I'll go over to each day. of you and see why you ended up popping. Are we ready? Two different kinds. I'm gonna oh, try. okay. Well, with that being said, London let's pound go cake. ahead and bring out our first single Hazel lady. Try this London pound cake. London pound cake, Mike. I think I like six dudes Welcome this time. In. Okay. What's your oh, name? See this, see this. Andrea. Andrea, how old are you? I'm 30. And what do you do? I'm a dental office receptionist. You can tell by them gums. Uh, what are some things I can do for fun? She'll never use the teeth, so they the call me young gummy. I'm never going to meet. What I do for fun is being at home. I do love nature. Look at <laughs> I like taking walks. Um, I will go out on occasion, so I like comedy shows if you want to go out. Okay. Um, I want to get more into traveling, which is something I hope to do she next year. She like Bianca so Belair at the top. Working out for myself. Mm -hmm. At the top. Um, but yeah, oh, nose that, up. I, whatever my person likes to do, honestly, okay. I'm pretty open. Nice. <laughs> now, speaking nice. of your person, what are some things you look for in them? I am looking for a leader and my best friend. Mm. As what far as killing them jeans? What I'm actually looking for. Killing jeans, so she got them. As far as traits, you mean? Yeah, whatever it is. What's something like when you're trying to find out? Oh, okay, I think I like this person. What are some traits you look for? Definitely, um, I'm looking for someone who is strong. Like I said, I'm looking for a leader. Um, someone who has good that, character. Yeah, um, she got on, someone man. Discipline. You need to see that. Who can she got on. Me and pick me up. You see also that side boob she got over there? It's kind of who has empathy. <laughs> I can go on. <laughs> okay. Now, so. what are some of your deal breakers? Not small. Let's yeah. see. Deal breakers would be lack of affection. Mm. Um, need a hug. Need, we're she kind of look like um. You said WNBA chick to be on Gears of I need you to show affection to me. I like to cuddle. I like Lexi. to kiss all of that. Um, <laughs> Lexi Brown. Another one would probably be. I would say if you just, you're not growing as okay. a person. Yeah. All right, cool. Oh, this, this is a right. short so episode, too. How many minutes balloon. is this? Okay. Let's go on over there, see why they ended up popping. 53 minutes. All right. If we can go ahead and start with your name and age. I'm Ricky. I'm 32. And Ricky, what do you uh, do? I'm a regional manager for a security company, and I work for Metro Valley for personal protection for the fair revenue team. I work two jobs. Nice, nice. Okay. I work two jobs. <laughs> so why did you end up popping your balloon? Don't get me Julia? Wrong. You're very beautiful. The attraction is there Julia's for me and everything. Rock. It's just you a homebody and it kind of seemed boring to me. Oh, that's okay. So it's like, oh, I'm trying to figure it out. I'm new to this state and everything like that. So 
I don't know what to do. You don't know what to do. We just be bored together, and yes. I don't want to waste a, your time with that. So it's good. It's, you're very beautiful. Thank like you. the attraction is there. So, but outside of that, it's just giving dull to me. Sorry about that. Dull. I get it. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> My headphones so break. I need to get some new headphones, man. No. Okay, and why not? You know your type. I prefer a more seasoned man. More seasoned. Oh, what do you mean? Like, what do you mean? <laughs> like by older. Um, Mature. That looks a little older. Um, if you will, a little, he doesn't look immature, but I just like the more mature, somewhat put together man, if you will. Yeah. You don't look like Kung Fu not, Kenny. Yeah. Right. type of look, I mean, just the more older okay. look. Oh, respect yeah. that. Respect mm -hmm. that. Oh, respect that. Respect that. Thank you. You got the style. All right. So we do still have five balloons left unpopped. Okay. I am going to go ahead and have you ask these guys a question. Just to help you narrow it down. See who's more of your type. So you need a waist okay. trainer on um, um, our lip. What that, do you that, look for in a woman? They look real boxy. Okay. Let's start over here with your name and up age. In, up in, up in, hey, up how you doing? My name is Ishama. I'm 37. You got a man. Hey, Ishama, what do you do? You know, I work in production like and I also do photography as well. Okay. And if you want to just go ahead and answer her question, what do you look for in a woman? Someone that's uh, cool, down to earth, um, like to go out, eat, um, travel, exercise. I'm not really a big exerciser in my current state, but I love, I do like someone that's uh, motivated in that way where we could uh, also motivate each other as well you know what i'm saying Absolutely. so like someone to motivate me and it's um, gonna be the boring group also, i see uh, someone that's just outgoing and just family oriented as well too yes. so that's a big thing okay yeah well, thank, thank you it's going over here if i we like that start with your name blue shirt he got on though my name is nelson I'm 38 years old oh low nelson, old. what do you do manager for the united states postal service okay and now her question was what are some things you look for in a woman what I look for is uh, also my best lips? friend, a uh, woman who's relentless, who's not going to give up on a relationship when things get hard and when we have a disagreement, a woman who's ambitious, uh, who wants to better herself, uh, humble and humorous as well. Okay. Nice. Straight to the he don't like girls. <laughs> Bang, boom. John Stewart is at the desk. Bang, boom. It's new. Breaking down this election <laughs> before it breaks you down. I ain't watching no damn Daily Show. Come Comedy on. Central's The Daily Show. All new. Let's go to our next guy here. Your name and age? I'm Cedric. I'm 32. And Cedric, what do you do? I work in sports. I work in media. And I'm a sports agent. Okay. okay. Very cool. Now, oh, I remember him. Woman? Um, just high quality woman. Just someone who hey, Jimmy Butler. knows her mind, speaks her mind. Um, just well mannered and put together. Okay. Let's go to our next guy. Your name and age? Trey. I'm 29. Trey, what do Trey, you do? Trey, I'm 29. Customer service rep for a door manufacturer. And what do you look for in a woman? Well, I zest on like the my stage, best friend, man. Somebody who's willing to work through problems and not just run out. You know what I'm saying. I think Pretty um the dude the in the black probably well in the woman. first dude probably the straightest dudes okay. up there. Let's go to our last guy here. Your name and age? Yeah, my name is Timothy. I'm 37. Hi. Timothy, what do you do? Um, I'm an independent contractor and a professional day trader. Okay. And what do you look for in a woman? Uh, someone that's uh, open-minded, um, also who's willing to grow with me and help me problem solve. Mm. Not just worry about you no know, challenges, but if there's something that comes up, kind of can work. We gonna start bringing men on men on here. I know that's coming. Okay, you'll get a whole All new right, platform let's head for on that. Back. I know that's a them. lot of information, a lot of information. <laughs> well, woman on woman, you switch it up and do that because this group right here. Pop some balloons. Okay. So there's a lot of now. Um, you hold this. And I am going to have you Baby, pop oh, did it. two balloons. Baby, oh, okay. did Based it. Based off of what you see, what you've heard, whatever it is, go ahead and pop those balloon. two, and then we'll see why you popped. Yeah. <laughs> I can't ask another question, can I? Next nah, round. man, yeah. come on. Yeah, man. I figured. <laughs> come on, Gummy. I to say, this is a lot harder when you're actually on the set versus I bet, I bet. <laughs> um, okay. She like, she work out or something. She look. I'm she, sorry. Oh, it won't. It's not going to pop. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. There we go. Okay, one more. Okay, I'll have you stay right there. We'll start over here. Okay, and Timothy. And why did you have your balloon unpopped? Oh, yeah, she's uh, very attractive. Um, I like the dress and everything. Um, didn't get enough information, but a date would probably, I wouldn't know a lot. And, um, why are you dressed like Mr. Wilson? I don't think that was a good decision, to be honest with you. You know what I mean? You would have learned a lot from me. No, he, he would, dressed it like... It took me one date. That was it. He dressed like the one dude date. on Tool Time on and the other side. I would have won you on one date. Wilson. Sure. 
100%. That's what I'm talking about, Wilson. Okay. Mm. <laughs> oh, was that his face covered up? We end up popping his balloon. Nigga, just like Wilson um, from Tool Time. Home I Improvement. Would probably be interested mm. in getting to know him, but I mean, this is, if we're being honest, it's just a show. So I have to go first off of physical appearance. Okay. I like that shirt um, he got, though. That, the shirt he got but, underneath it. Um, I'll rock that. Would be, you know, a more older, uh, seasoned man as far as, you know, the way he dresses and what have you. Um, you dress like Wilson from more Home older Season man, kind of a comment. how much older are you, are you talking? <laughs> Just curious. <laughs> um, late thirties, early forties, usually. I don't mind. I mind this man in his early thirties, but it just has the look of like early twenties, if you will, that dress type. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That makes sense. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right, thank yeah. you. Okay. And we did pop one more back here. Okay. And why did you have your balloon unpopped for her? Um, yeah, she's a attractive young lady. She's a attractive She looks man. nice. We're around the same age, so I understand. I get it. Thank she you. want an older man. So. Oh, yeah. So, you know how this go. Come on, man. Give my man oh, somebody, man. Yo. Um, same thing. You know, like I said, for, sorry. For he going been on here before, first, man. He's he a, he a cool dude, preference. man. That's all. Give my boy some look. That Thank dude beside him in all white is disgusting. All right. So we do have three you remaining sure? guys. Let's go ahead and ask them another you question. Questionable. Okay. I probably should have asked this first. Um, how do you feel about a woman with children? Okay. Start over here. I got kids too, so. Okay. Ain't nothing but a chicken wing. You know? Okay. Ain't nothing but a chicken wing. Ain't nothing but a chicken okay. wing. Let's go over here. You got no problem with that. I got kids myself. So we'll be a whole happy bunch. But uh, I got a question for you, though. Yes. Do you have baby daddy drama? I do not. Okay. No, sir. Beautiful. <laughs> what type of man wearing about baby daddy drama? Men don't worry about baby daddy drama. Um, Women myself, worry about baby mama drama. Not get Dudes be like, one. Hey, about that nigga? Anything over one, probably no. Okay. Okay. And, and I ain't no dudes scared of no... Like, see, that's some punk shit. Okay. <laughs> dudes ain't scared <laughs> of no baby one. daddies. <laughs> All right. So, he said end up popping over the kids, but is okay. he someone that's your type? No. Okay. And why not? Uh, same thing. It's just uh, first preference. So. That shirt looks okay. snug too. So you did have your balloon on pop for her for quite some time until you heard she has more than one kid. Yeah, he really different um, on woman. Why so? That is the only reason. No, I mean like, why did you have it on pop before that? <laughs> she's very attractive. Um, other than more than one kid, she's perfect in my eyes. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. You okay. can't put that on a and woman. We did get a kids, pop good. back here. Okay. We'll look at this dude. He just want to win with somebody. Look at him, man. Um, it's beautiful. Like something wrong with the, the yellow dude. Stuff, but. I mean, I'm very, I'm visual as hell, mm -hmm. and like the nails, I yes. didn't care for it so much. Mm -hmm. Plus, like the, I'm not really a fan of the fit too much. But okay. you are again gorgeous. I don't understand this. How do no turn down on that? Like I'm sitting up there as a, as a, okay. Thank you. As a content creator, yeah. judging women by outfits, but a dude, you yeah. ain't trying to talk to. Me. Me. I ain't judging no yeah. girl off her yeah. outfit, yeah. man. Has a sweet, for, uh, friendly face. <laughs> I ain't looking at no girl turning down no Thank ass. You. Just because right, her outfit so look crazy. Unpop so. okay. the balloon. Let's head on know, over maybe, there. Not in okay, public. Any questions for our lady here? I do. I do. Um, I do. I, I do. Everyone here popped their balloon. So let's be honest here. So, sure. who would uh, out of these gentlemen was your first choice? Based put, off of what? Based off of looks. See, look at him. Wow, that's okay. <laughs> I have it's to only, answer this, don't I? It's only like, it's honest, only, yeah. it's only like six dudes up there. Honest. Yeah. It would have been you. Oh. oh. Like, he yeah, liked that. Oh. <laughs> All right. And why is that, if, if I may ask? You fit my type. I like your facial features. I like right. the way you dress. You feminine, You're though. You gonna, um, but also, you don't need to be loud. You yeah, know yeah. what I mean? So, you sure? Yeah, I could be loud. I know you can. I do have another question, though. Um, sure. Do you want more kids? I'm content with my two, and I would love more kids either way. Okay. Yeah, All right. either way. All right, let me, come All right. on up. Come you got to talk yourself out of it. <laughs> okay. So, I have a final question, unless you guys have any others. We got a little here. This is the first girl to work oh. for the short dude. And uh, you gotta talk uh, where do you live at? Kansas City. Chiefs fan? Depends. <laughs> Depends, right? Depends on who you ask. How do you, I live in the Bay Area. So, how do you feel about flying to the Bay? Because, I, I mean, I have no problem flying over there. So, I said I'm down to travel. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right. Especially for this, the this, this is weird. This is weird right here. <laughs> Perfect. So. Okay. So, then is it going to be a yes for you for her? Uh, yes, ma'am. Right. He, he, he got a mask on. Him. That's what I see. He got, he we wearing got a mask. A mask. He's trying to portray like he. <laughs> I'll take this oh, mic man. and you guys can go on up. Let's give it up for them. <laughs> Your vagina gonna smell like Dookie. Nah. The Pope is dead. The throne ah! is dead. 
about sorry, sure. the most famous. I'm sorry, okay, sure. let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. You will never hear him fart. <laughs> Hello, welcome in. All right. Oh, what? 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 Uh, Brianna. What? Brianna? What? How old are you? Uh, I'm 29. Oh. And what do you do? Um, I'm an entrepreneur. You're okay. a tall midget. Do you have any businesses we could be on the lookout for? Uh, no, just not right now. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, Lord. <laughs> now, what are some things they popped on her quick. Oh, Lord. Um, they don't want none of that. That's healthy. I'm a gamer, so I just more be to myself. Okay. Um, I'm a PC gamer, so I got like, I'm a gamer. That's all. Okay. <laughs> That's what I love. You to sit do. on that, that <laughs> thing back right. there. Um, and now, what are some things um, to burn a man? Um, Lord, a confident man. You, you should have went to the tavern. Um, you shouldn't have came on the show. I don't know. You a bar a man chick. He knows about himself. A nigga you know, at the bar will swoop um, you up, yo. Last call for alcohol. Not really set, you know, just oh, more shit. of he knows what he want to go for. Mm. Um, I'm telling you. So, you know, just a confident man. This ain't, this ain't this thing okay. for you, shorty. Now, what are some deal breakers? Uh, a felon. Look um, at my man over there. He got to get somebody. Um, he want to win. He said, no, I, I take it down. Man. I don't like nobody that just judge, you know, off of appearance or anything like that. Mm. So, okay. that's really it. Cool. Mm -hmm. All right, so we did get a few pop balloons. Mm -hmm. Let's go on over there, see why they ended up popping. Okay. All right, let's start here with your name and age. How you doing? Uh, my name is Ishama. I'm 37. Okay. And Ishama, why did you end up popping Ishama. your balloons? I like his blue shirt. I, it was I don't like that. I hate Carolina yeah. blue, but I, I like that. I'm just not a fan of too much oh, tattoos fine. and stuff like that. And tattoos are bad, I have too. I tattoos myself. Mm -hmm. It's just like, yeah, you fix them up. Much, but gorgeous yourself, though. Thank you. No problem. Now, is Ishama someone that's your type? You're not bad looking. Appreciate you look young. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Let's go to our next guy. Your name and age. Ricky, and I'm 32. Nice to meet you. And Ricky, why did you end up popping your balloon? First and foremost, I couldn't get past the shoes. It's like they squeezing your feet. And it's like, <laughs> wow. Wow. Mm -hmm. wow. I mean, another thing, the physical attraction just mm -hmm. wasn't there for me. Mm -hmm. Like, wasn't my speed. Like, when I look at something, I want to be like, oh, I got to get that. Or, right. I, I need that. And it's just right. like. I know oh, what you're okay. saying. She, that's what I'm telling you. So, Last yeah. call for alcohol at the tavern, okay. at right. the bar. Yeah. So is Ricky the, someone um, that's your type? At the I bingo cool. hall. Man, you can pull her. Huh? Cool. You got a strong face. Oh. I love it, though. You mean like his jawline? Is that what yeah. you're Yeah, oh, cheekbones, okay. jawline. <laughs> you should eat a lot more, but I love it. Thank you. Appreciate that. Mm -hmm. You should eat a lot less. Well, Thank so you. I never I thought I wasn't. Thank you. Let's go on over here to our next guy. I know he could have got her. Trey and I'm 29. Hello. Trey, why did you end up popping your balloon? Uh, kind of like what my boy said down there, just a neck tattoo. I don't really like it. So that nigga beard look thing on under his that okay. little thing mm -hmm. look nasty. Tattoos. Yeah, <laughs> I love them. They're my favorite part about me. Yeah, yeah. 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 You look nasty. Uh, Is that what that says? Uh, yes, it does. Oh, yeah. Okay. You cool <laughs> yeah. Okay. So he's cool. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> Let's go over here. Okay. Okay. Your name and age. Timothy, I'm 37. Okay. Hi. And Timothy, why did you end up popping your balloon? I'm um, just not attracted. I don't like the tattoos and the legs. Everybody saying the tattoos. tattoos. Man, you ain't got, man let, let it be. I just don't see myself having fun with you. Like, let let her came with a full fun. sleeve. Right. You know, just. Thinking light like skin okay. or something with some long hair. The she weight, look better. You're, you're kind of overweight for me, too. Okay. Oh, I don't say that, bruh. Okay. All right. So is Timothy someone that's your type? No, he looks his age. Oh. He does look like he's 37. It's okay though. Okay. He's about nine, ten years older than me. But I do. You, it's cool. Man, you crazy, man. <laughs> y'all missing out on that. I mean, y'all ain't no. So we do have one unpopped balloon. Somebody, right? well, somebody slam um, dunk a big ass. Y'all crazy. Yeah, how many kids you got? I got three. <laughs> Look, man, y'all. Kids obviously are a deal breaker. But before that, is she someone that's your type? Yeah, she look good. You know, I like the tattoos. You know, that's look, they look nice. But Thank you. Just the kid is my limit. I ain't gonna lie. Y'all crazy, I can't, man. Y'all can't lie to you. That's good. It's some, boy, you no, definitely crazy. Someone, that's your type. No. Okay. What makes him not your type? The way he looks. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not trying to be funny. He's just not my type. Not nah, for oh. real. He like Jimmy oh. Butler. The way he looks, like his the face. outfit. Oh. His face, Jimmy okay. Butler. He's fine. Okay. Very cool. Thank you. Okay. You like chew tobacco. You're making me laugh. I'm not trying not to. He should be the last person laughing on this stage. Oh. Yeah. Who? The last guy? Yeah. Why are you laughing at him? Oh. Oh, okay. Sorry. Get him. Okay. Get him, Shorty. Get him. <laughs> all right. Well, that is all the Get him. pops. Get him. Bobby, do you thank you so much for coming. She got three on. kids Let's for a reason. Give it up for her, guys. I bet I thank Thank, thank you. <laughs> Thank you.
He looked like, what me? I'm just, boy, look. He told me you should be the last thing laughing. Y'all crazy, man. All right, let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. In, at the, hey, at, late night at the club, yo, I'm telling you. And she ain't horrible. Hello, welcome in. What's your name? I'm Kay. Look Kay, how old are you? I'm 30. And what do you do? I am a so, fashion designer, a stylist, and I'm a toddler teacher. Oh, that's a cute. <laughs> a toddler teacher. <laughs> with a little red patch in the head. She got the Kwame. Um, travel. Um, skate. I'm a roller skater. Okay. So, yeah. <laughs> um, I like to draw. I am a gamer girl, shit. so I like to play video games oh, when I am brush it. in the house. Oh, I need to line up. Okay. That's it. <laughs> now, what are um, some things you look for in a man? Someone that likes to travel, spontaneous. Um, Y'all like ain't got fun. no pics. A little bit introverted. They play the women up here. Like we can go out, but I, I don't want to go out like that. Not all the time. No. No. <laughs> nah. All right. And now, um, what are some of your deal breakers? Said model name Takara. Takora. My deal breakers are kind of like Her face. Okay. basic, but a lot of men like these. Okay. So um, communicative, chivalrous, Shiver. spiritual. No spirit. And uh, is in therapy or willing to go to therapy? I feel as though everyone needs therapy. Okay. So if you feel like you don't need therapy, baby, don't come over here. Okay. Why do you think somebody <laughs> needs therapy? All right. So we have no pop balloons. See, out of pop balloons. great. Okay. So what that means is I'm actually going to go ahead and switch it on over to you. So let me hand you a people pick. Try to make other people okay. come out. Behold that. And for this first round, I'm going to have you pop one balloon, just based off of what you're seeing, whoever's not really your type, whatever it is, maybe it's outfit, it's I don't know. Cake stuff. Go ahead we'll and pop we'll we'll that balloon, and then we'll see why you ended sure up popping. A little, a little help okay. over there. Let me see. Oh, them shoes are nasty. Oh, Jimmy Butler. All right, let's start over here with your... We always get Jimmy Butler I'm out of here. I'm 31. Okay. And Cedric, why did you have your balloon unpopped? She looks nice. Thank you. <laughs> All right. And now, why did we end up popping his balloon? Um, Just the initial attraction. Okay. Um, she's yeah. six. Was there anything specific? She can be a seven. She can be a seven. The outfit. The outfit, yeah. yeah. Okay. All oh, right, cool. Thank probably you. she smelled Let's good, so she probably like, she like and an for eight. this next you know? round, I'm going to have you ask the guys a question just she to help you narrow it down. Um, outfit. Okay, so mm-hmm. what is one thing that your closest friends will say that is that you need to work on as far as friendship and a partnership? All right. I, I don't Start got no over friends here with and know your my name and age is the answer to her question. What type of shit is that? That's a dumb that question. a tough one right there. Um, it's dumb. Good. Ishama, I am 37. What's your Ishama. name? Ishama. Ishama? Yeah. Okay, she like that. Nice to meet you. Nice uh, she like that. What's that? Friends with What's that? I need to work on. I got the corniest name. My name Dennis. Probably be like me reaching out if I need help or something like that. Cause I'm usually like, I could do this on my own. I could do this on my own. You got no cool nah, name. Sometimes I need to go out there and just ask for help. He had a nickname you know, growing up. So, okay. That's pretty much it, I think. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a junior. Y'all wasn't DJ. And partnership. <laughs> partnership. Yeah. Oh. So friendship and partnership. That's crazy. Partnership would what be. Is Dennis? My sisters had nicknames and I didn't. Oh man. My mama, birdie fishing did something. My partner would probably want me to. My partner oh. might ask me to do as well too. It's just like, again, probably reaching out or just. Uh, I don't know. That's what for me. I need to go back. I gotta come back for that one. Okay. Okay. That was dumb. That was a okay. dumb question. A tough question. It right. was a dumb question. Okay. Go to our next guy. <laughs> Your name and age. Well, somebody took the damn question. thing. You be Ricky. Stamping. I'm thirty-two. Bingo. Bingo. Something I need to work on Hit is a friendship head. that all my friends say because all my friends are established, married, families, and everything. And there's me. So I need to understand and work on that uh, I'm the single friend in life. So I, I love to fight that nigga right there. Every day. Like, what hey, nigga? Do this. Boom! And punch him right in his chest right I'm here. Single friend too. Okay. Mm-hmm. Which is what nigga I'm trying fall to do. Nigga fall back like the Matrix, boy. That's all. Relationship, you got what I need to incredible work hope. And understand <sighs> is that I think a lot that I've learned. Yeah, no chest. Is no I'm chest. I'm a big downfall with that. Like the reason I don't have the relationship that I'm looking for now is because of what I'm liking. When I'm, you know, used to, I can't get that happily ever after. Mm-hmm. based on what I like and everything. So I need to realize my wants and needs and everything like that and get that. I need to go Baby back to the drawing right board in. and really have more predictable or understandable terms. And, you know, when it comes to looking for a relationship like that, so just lower my expectations a little bit like that. And maybe I find Never that lower your expectations. <laughs> that was dumb. Never lower them. If you want what you want, stick to it. Look, it's, it's kind of like... Sorry. It's kind of like 
looking for love in today's generation. It's like I'm looking for that old school love with modern You're looking woman. for a four leaf clover. It's okay. Stick to it. That's fine. But when I'm surrounded by Gen Z type of women mentality, like no, you ain't. young women mentality. Change your environment. <laughs> this bitch, That's you why I'm in Arizona. Time. Chicago, AZ. <laughs> okay. Let's go to our next guy. Look, that little patch on her this head. is the mark of a fighter. She's smart. A rich, full flavor. You can tell she got some education. Crisp. Well, she's a good chess player. She's she like, she like Trey on 29. Um, as far as friendship, probably communicating, like when needing help, reaching out. Um, relationship wise, probably expressing my you like a wife beater, a woman beater before things like he get mad at his eyebrows. Where like you should have expressed him in the beginning. You look I mad. Be better with just expressing smile, him, like, brother. The beginning of like when I when I feel yes, him, letting that my partner know your Other partner. That, See, that'd probably be the two main things. Out of those. It's, it's, you know, let me know you exist. Okay. If you say partner, I ain't Thank never you. had a partner over here. Your name and age. And Always had a girl. Well, wife. Nice. My name is Timothy. I'm 37. Um, as far never as had no partner. I would say straight um, men don't say partner. They would probably want me to it's level up more, more like finan financially. And as a partnership, it's my I would boo, say it's my one, it's my everything, my earth, my queen. Pay attention to more detail with the women, for sure. Okay. Okay. All right, let's head on back, and it is time to pop. Oh, you, you want to add something? Okay. <laughs> all right, so all right, so my thing is, I'm very picky. In certain things, and I also I expect a lot from my partner sometimes, and I think that could be a downfall for me. So like when I'm with that person, sometimes I could be a little picky sometimes with what she do or what it might be the case. But I'm trying to work on that side of me. I'm a Virgo, so that's a part of me. So, so I don't yeah. get the damn the zest vibe from him. <laughs> he he did use partner, but he ain't got the zest that's vibe. Nice All right, so I am gonna have you pop one balloon. Based off of, you know, whatever you heard, whatever it is, go ahead and pop. The other boy, baby, with the damn pearls or whatever the necklaces. Okay. No one wants to pop. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. You said just one? Just one. Okay. Pop yours. All right. So, why did we end up popping his balloon? His response lack of affection. I feel like. That's like one of the first things she said, wasn't it? Just my love language is affectionate is like the least, like the last one for me, but I can be affectionate. Yeah, outfit, look, she got them kind of disgusting. So we both love, can't like those things. Like one of us right there, have you need something to want to give that part of us. You know? that out and then you said level up with you your finances. Something. I don't know what that looks like for you. Fix um, shit again. Get that but for me, out like, of finances is, isn't a big thing, but I'm a big person. And... At one point, at some point, finances would be a big thing for me because of like who I am. I'm a designer. I'm a stylist, okay. and like so, I'm up. We can be talking about style. Right? She's a stylist. So like, I want at least us. I want us to be at the same level. If that I'm makes sense. Black t-shirt. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. He ain't got no style. Yeah, um, you just like Wilson. I would say, I've been told that before. So when I say pay attention to more detail, more I've like been told that before. I may not be in that moment. And you may want some affection. It's got damn base in your voice. There at the moment, but if I pay more attention to detail, I can pick up. Okay, you want to be held or something like that. Why you like, hey, when you got shot? Thing. It's not like mm -hmm. he's a meeting rich. I'm not doing nothing. It's just those little detail things I get in the parking lot. I, had I get spanked for pretty much. Okay, <laughs> paid in yeah. full. Yeah. Those little things would be big things. That's true. That's true. <laughs> yeah. That's true. I ain't seen a nigga all Thank day, you. B. Okay, <laughs> let's go ahead and ask another question. Me? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> okay. Um, what is, what's the most spontaneous thing that you've done that you shouldn't have done, oh. but it was, it was fun? And you was just like, I mean, this is getting kind of boring. I got my damn fidget spinner out here now. Mm, I see why this like episode fifty something. Like, what? It's a whack group, okay. whack oh, questions. Ready. Let's go to one that's already ready. Let's start right here. Flew somebody out on their period. Oh, what? <laughs> Never again. It, uh, was, it was fun. Did we you had, know that she was on her period? Oh, yeah, of course. I'm definitely checking with that. But then for me, it's like, okay, now I know you're on your period. What's well, going to look like if I change my flight now? Now it's going to look did like. Did you use protection? Did you use. No, we, we didn't do anything. I mean, we had a. The time was So bad. you wasted time and money. Y you feel me? 
No, I don't. Because why you fly her on the first place? See, but that's my thing. Cause like, it's a personal close friend of mine and everything tried to take it like that. But then, like I said, when I realized, oh, it ain't nothing happening. Like, I don't care about having fun. So you wasted her time. How? She got a free trip. Yeah, but she came out. It don't matter if it's a free trip. She with you. What that mean? Or were you not spending time together? Yeah. Everything she wanted. I dropped the bat, did everything. But it's like, like I said, that was something fun Man, that shut I wouldn't up. do again. Like you said, that you, was fun. Yeah, it was fun. It was fun for who? That nigga lame, for both dog. of us. That nigga corny. Okay, that nigga you lame. Love, then so, that's all so, that matters. So in order for you to have fun and connect and to be with somebody like that, sex got to be involved. I didn't say sex. That's what your perception. I never said that. But, I was. You said on her period. So the first thought that came to everybody. Why you want to argue with a woman? Yeah. Sex. You, you want to talk her down? Period. You want to back? So you yeah. had. You want to have a fight? Type of you want to have indication a disagreement. that you, you wanna wanted have a, to have sex with her, right? You want to have a debate with the bitch. Period. You know, who gets flew out and not expect to get Exactly. Sex. So you saying so you what, try to put that on me and say that my see? thought of, like, having fun had to deal with sex. No. Well, you know you women are period. lawyers, boy. You can't so fucking you're period, argue with her. Then automatically I'm going to say, yeah. Because if you say I flew her out on her period, I'm going to yeah. be like, okay, he wanted to have sex with me. <laughs> Sir, yeah. <laughs> not fly you out there. So, oh, I just want to fly you out to get to know you. We got FaceTime for that. Video chat. Facebook. But it's, it's FaceTime and text messages is different when you're in person. Okay. It's a different type of energy. Let's go on to our next guy over here. All right. I'm not going to say I re I'm not, I wouldn't do it again. Woo! But um, I'm, I think this doing this in itself was just like spontaneous. Like mm -hmm. I got the call. I just came back from a trip. And I was like, hey, uh, would you like to come on the show? I was like, oh, shoot. And the crazy thing is I signed up for the show when I was on vacation. Wow. So it was insane. Uh, I'm sorry if I'm letting out the cat out the back. But, yeah. Um, you that was on vacation with someone? No, I was with my family. Okay. I was made it 30 family. minutes okay. without coffee. I got, I got, I got, I got <laughs> you. Right. No, I was with the family. It was on my last right. head. It was, no, it was a great It was vacation. on my head last um, video. But um, that was last just part spontaneous to just come out here right after for that. For real, I mean, bro? Your I coffee? Mean, would I, coffee on the street? I would do it again, but it yeah, was nigga. definitely a good time. And it is a great time. as I, I, I muted this right time. Now, so I tried yeah. to. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And then we got one more guy. Smoke good weed. Kind of like him, man. Join, um, being on the show right here is probably the most spontaneous thing recently because it's out of like out of the box for me so I mean I'm enjoying the experience right now so far and hopefully it goes well at the end for me okay you look like an eagle or something let's head on back and it is time to pop a balloon <laughs> that's <laughs> perfection <laughs> relax hold on hold on let's let her pop let's let her pop <laughs> you want to get pop Okay. <laughs> you tried it. Oh. Let's see. She okay. want the nigga she want to argue with. Well, so where did we end up popping his? Um, he said the same thing as him. So it wasn't really no authenticity. It, yeah. It you didn't set yourself up like outside the box for me. Okay. That was it. All right. Like you guys don't take no no fun trips. <laughs> yeah, I do, but I haven't done any recently. It don't have to be recent. It could be from 10 years ago. I mean, losing money in Vegas? A couple of months. I mean, do that you count? You should have said that. Oh, I say, I mean, <laughs> you didn't the most say that. Fun since then. I mean, you get a little joy out of losing the money, but I mean, when you drive you home, it's kind of like sad. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> never, never play with your winnings. Uh -huh. All right. So we do have two guys left. Guys, any question for our beautiful lady here? How did Ella's yeah, become the best bakery in town? It all started with one smart decision. Welcome in. Come on. Okay, let's start here. Mentally, like, where are you at in your life right now? Like, space, are you working through some stuff? Are you like, um, how's family life? And like, just your family as well too. Are you very family oriented or more or less a, a loner? But three on one question, okay. Yes, yes, it started off with one, but um, now it's three. How am I mentally yes. right now? Yeah. Um, what's the, what's like the, the number is like a one to 10 no, or just tell me how you feel like this like, episode, like, not, not a number is just like, how do you feel? It's sponsored by melatonin. Mentally, like, so I am a taller teacher. So that comes with a lot of stresses. Um, taller kids put me to are, sleep. they're a handful. Mm -hmm. They're two. <laughs> so like a lot of people like to say like terrible twos. Gotcha. I don't like to say that about my tallers. They're terrific twos, but some of them are. Yeah, 
<laughs> yeah. Gotcha. But um, it's not that bad. My mental is pretty pretty well. Gotcha. Um, I do do therapy. That's why I ask if that's like not <clears throat> ask, but that's one of my deal breakers. Willing or in therapy because therapy really helps. Um, just to talk to somebody that's unbiased because your friends are very biased about you. Um, so yeah, mentally I am a okay. What's your next question? Family, like, uh, like, are you very family oriented? Like, I am family you, you're at the cookout every time you bring in the, the, the. If there is a cookout, yes, I am there, and gotcha. I'm sorry, DC, but I like Lizzie's. <laughs> <laughs> Lizzie's and hot dogs is on my plate. I mean, um, hamburgers is on my plate. So yes, I am at the cookout when it comes to like, if my family is throwing a cookout, I'm gotcha. there. So yeah, I'm very family oriented. I'm closer. I'm close to my brother and my sister. This was up. Up. cool. Okay. Thank you. Any questions here? Short and simple. Should I just want to know how many kids you got, if okay. you have any? I have one daughter. What about you? I have two boys. <laughs> okay. Um, same mother, different mother? Same mother. You Technically are... one by DNA, but I claim to. Okay. Um, previous, previously married. Never been married, engaged, none of that. <clears throat> how old are you? 32. Okay. You, What's that? Yeah. you said two boys? Ooh. Two boys. Jay and JoJo, six and ten, nine. Okay, that's not bad. My daughter's six. Okay, perfect. Good. You might want pop, bro. <sighs> we are down to two. It is time to pop one. <laughs> I know it's tough. They had some good responses. I know. You got to pick. <laughs> you got to pick. <laughs> Follow your heart. Oh, man. The one on your head, bitch. Okay. Um, I can't ask another question. Mm, no. Go ahead and pick. Not just a one. Is it a quick response or is it long winded? <laughs> Never mind. Okay. <laughs> Pop it. Only because you had it out. You might as well put it this time. Put it out. Because you had it out. You can spin a block. There we go. <laughs> like I don't want no All right. I know. I saw it was really, really tough to pick between these two. So why did you end up popping his? They both had really great answers, to be honest. Yeah. Um, I just went with it because he already, you perceived. Like, mm. your perception is your projection. So if you already thought that it was going to be you, then you are trying to put yourself out the game. It's not fair to you. It's a disservice to you. You're very handsome. You're very nice. I like your answers. But you try to put yourself out the game, and that wasn't fair to you. He's still going to get him. Okay. <clears throat> so, and you saw I walked past you. So don't do that again. <laughs> not for me, but just for other <laughs> just for he, other he gonna people. He's going to spin the block. Don't He's going to spin the block. Yourself because you never know. Respect. Okay. Respect. Cool. Let's head on back. Let me bring you on up here. Let's Big Kendrick Souls. I pop okay. if I was him. So, like, you wanted that other nigga? Man, get out of here. Bit. Any final questions? Uh, not really. I think I he got just want to win. Answered. Okay. What about for yourself? Um, is it long? It has to be a long. It can't be long winded. Ask your question. I know you want to ask it. Go ahead and ask it. Okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> sorry. What do you do? I work in production. Camera operator. You live here? No. Where do you live? New York. Okay, great. <laughs> oh, I don't live in New York. I live in DC, but it's. I heard you say it earlier. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I just said so. Long distance isn't, isn't a problem for you. I mean, we get to know each other. Far. We get to know each other. That's not a problem. Okay, great. All right. So it sounds like that's it. So my final question: Is it a yes for you for her? Yeah, most definitely. Uh, and is it a yes for you for him? Yes. We got a match! <laughs> I'll take this mic, Thank and you guys can go on off. <laughs> Thank you. Let's give it up for them, y'all. Give it up, give it up, give it up. He's going to spend a block. He's going he gonna to get shorty. All right. Let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. <clears throat> Hello. Welcome in. Hi. What's your name? My name is Alexis. Okay. And how old are you? I'm 29. All right. And what do you do? I'm a realtor. Okay. And Alexis, we did have you on the show before, and you actually did end up matching. So what happened? Um, 
it just didn't work out. Okay. So I'm back again looking for love. Yes. Welcome back. You're <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah. 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 Things you like to do for fun. It ain't, it, um, I really like just enjoying tight life, enough. you know, trying to she have definitely fun. got a cute face. She has some thighs um, on. I like traveling and going on vacation, things like that. Doing like arcades, amusement parks. So she's been on the show so. before. Okay. Mm-hmm. Now, she what's she cute for a man? Um, someone who's honest and has good communication. Someone who is a leader, but also values my voice and my opinion. Mm-hmm. Okay. And them thighs. Some deal breakers. Probably someone who's dishonest or unloyal. Okay. And uh, someone who's too friendly. Ooh. <laughs> you like, I'm a little mean to others, huh? <laughs> Just a little. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we have no pop balloons. So I'm going to go ahead and have you ask these guys a question just to kind of help us narrow it down a little bit. This is going. Okay. <clears throat> Um, well, why are you guys here? Why did you sign up for Pop the Balloon? Find a bitch. What do you think? Yeah. Start right on over here. Name and age, and why did you sign up for Pop the Balloon? Ricky, 32. Dating pool got pee in it. That's to sum it up. This sucks out here in Arizona. Uh, Let's go to our next guy. Name and age, stupid. and why are you here? She's like, yep. I'm Cedric. I'm 31. I signed <clears> up because, yeah, I'm looking for love and, you know, a right woman and, all that. I already got my oh, own everything. So just looking for that, you know, match. Put that out there. I got my own everything. Tell her. Tell her. Name and age, and why are you on Pop the Balloon? On Trey, I'm 29, and I'm here because I'm looking for love. I mean, I've tried every uh, obstacle. I figure this would be these, a good option these, to try. Well, look. And your name and age. And ah, you, oh, you got left with shorty. Uh, my name is Timothy. I'm 37. I'm here because to find love. And I think the, 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 the. having a strong relationship is probably the missing piece of my life. Okay. okay. Have you been here before? You look familiar. Oh, uh, yeah. Episode 15, yes. Okay. I thought so. <laughs> <laughs> episode 15. She said, I recognize that face. <laughs> okay. Right, okay. I'm going to hand you a pick. Let me get okay. one for you. She got a little monster back there, but. There you go. And I am going to have you pop one balloon based off of what you're seeing, what you've heard, whatever it may be. Go ahead and pop that one. Okay. <laughs> oh. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So why do we have to pop in his balloon? There? I'm just probably the physical. She need to get a little it's tighter. A little bit um, different from what I'm used to going with. Okay. But you seem like a nice guy. Like she it. she didn't get a tighter um, right, and Cedric, fit why did on you the outfit. Unpopped for her. When she was nice, she said she was a realtor, so you know it's all like works for me. So that was it. Okay, all right, thank you. Let's head on back. And Alexis, I'm gonna go ahead and have you ask these guys another question. <clears throat> okay. Um, she don't know how to dress though. Describe is... your perfect woman. Okay. <clears throat> He's still thinking. Let's start down there. <laughs> Oh, put that nigga on the spot, man. That nigga All right, describe me. your perfect woman. You made me put her son. You made me put That's a really good question. Um, I would say first off, someone that's open-minded, um, someone that has good listening skills as much as I do, um, someone who's definitely wanting to want to grow with me, not just not just be talking, because a lot of people jokers just be talking out here. They ain't they're not really serious. Um, and someone that's kind of like want to be like best friend and a teammate you know you have your thing i have my thing and then at times we come together to be a perfect unit at the end of the day okay i like that <laughs> okay the answer to her question i guess my perfect woman would be she like do some squats you can tighten that up a little bit man be my best friend well, someone tight- i can joke with play with uh communicate on my best bad it's days right, good days uh, you know um Someone it's, it's I just that knows right. I have their back and they just have my back, like even on um, bad or good days. But just somebody yeah. who's willing to work with somebody, build a build a relationship, not use the other person to gain something because more she, than that. She would allow her face because she had a pretty face. So well. Check out these deals of the week at Walgreens. Walgreens, if I won't get one free, okay. sandwich bread. <laughs> I mean, All right. that boy, that thing right there. Ricky, 32. I think the perfect woman for me... How many kids you got? Who takes the time to understand. See, look, 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 she, she got to keep pulling it up. Me, that shit ain't tight me. enough. She, she ordered it. She me as a man, like she, as a respectful she didn't order as a woman, it, you know, and a partner. And most important, important, shit too to me loose. Is somebody who's compatible. Because I think that's an overlooked art 
in a dating field because a lot of people, oh, you're attractive to me and everything, but you're not compatible. So compatibility is a main thing for me because we're compatible. It's to the moon from there. Okay. All right. Those are good yeah, responses, keep, huh? Keep in, in, in <laughs> okay, I'm gonna have you pop one balloon. Okay. Oh, it's getting harder now. I know, I know. <laughs> Shut up. Mm. Don't look at me like that, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Where are they supposed to look? <laughs> Where do you want them to look? <laughs> Not at me. <laughs> Sorry. All right, so why did we end up popping his? Um, I think I just like the other two answers more and probably physical attraction okay. more as well, so I'm sorry. You're fine. Right. And so why did you have your balloon unpopped for her? She's definitely beautiful. Um, the physical attraction is there. Um, I think she's very, very interesting. It can be more interesting if we got to know each other, but that's pretty much it. Okay. Right. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Let's head on back. And for our two guys left, any questions for our beautiful lady here? You have one? Okay, let's head down over here. Okay, what's your question? Um, so my question is, what is life, what is, what is doing life with, the, what, what is doing life with you like? Um, well, I think it's fun and I'm always trying to be positive so definitely a lot of positive this is so boring man i don't know um, i'm the type to motivate you and always this push you walk back and forth though good enough for this episode at least well. at least we did get to see so, that okay it's fun over here i see promise that monster. <laughs> i'm feeling that sounds pretty accurate i can see that some, some thighs on you boy i'm telling you, you let's head on back you see a walk back look boom, okay any boom, questions over here boom. Boom. Something see, easy. It, it need to be tightened up a little bit. We though. Shy, name, shy, right? You know? Where's the ideal date for you? What does that look like for you? Um, well, definitely not like the movies or someplace like where we wouldn't talk during the date. So probably, you know, like going somewhere like like I said, I like amusement parks and like stuff like that. Arcade. So somewhere where we could interact and get to know each okay. other more, hmm. even like, like dinner or something like picnic that. dates. Yeah. Horse rides and stuff. Yeah, I rides. actually like horseback riding. Oh. Say less. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it is time to pop. Out of these two guys, whose balloon are we popping? <laughs> okay. Um... I know it's tough. <sighs> Sorry. You do okay. you. I saw it was pretty hard, but why did we end up popping his? I like horseback riding. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. That was like the only thing I just, oh, that's, that's tough. You ain't no chance, bro. Well, I never rode horse, horses, but I was, I would be definitely open to doing things if you, whatever you will want to do. So, mm -hmm. dang, that was tough. Yeah, I'm I, sorry. You, yeah, you got it, for sure. <gasps> Okay, let's head on back. Thank you. She just didn't want to, right. he was on there for Let another on second here. time. Come on up here. Oh, look, he's confident. <laughs> Any final questions between either one of you? How soon are you available for a date? Pretty soon. <laughs> All right, then. So is it going to be a yes for you for her? It's hell yeah. Ooh. And is it a yes for you for him? Yes. We got a match. <laughs> I'll take this mic, and you guys can go on off. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, y'all, give it up for them. Give it up, give it up. He gave his boy a dap and didn't even touch the bitch. He just walked. Max Coalfield is back. He's on the wheels. Oh, Let's thrash. Ain't Shaka no connection Barack. going on now, with that. Now, the fates of you his friends. You can see that. He already gave a dap to the homies. Like, Yo, okay, so let's go do. ahead and bring out our next single lady. Well, look. This is a sad group, boy. Hello. Welcome in. What's your name? Hey. Brianna. Brianna, how mm -hmm. old are you? I'm 32. And what do you do? Um, I work in human resources. Okay, very cool. Okay, now, what okay. are some things like to do for fun? Um, for fun, I like to just kick it with my family. Kick I'm it. A real homebody. Like Nivea. So we'll get together, oh. cook, music, all that. Don't okay. mess and with now, my what man. What are some things to look for in a man? Um, just some shows. He has to be a hustler. He has to be ambitious, passionate, um, driven. Does she have on contacts? Kind of okay. Does now, what are some deal breakers? Um, I don't like somebody who's emotionally unintelligent. Mm. 
Um, I don't like somebody who doesn't stand on their own. We need to see a face. Um, we can't really see it. I like it. a man who is she like a who? driven, whatever that may be. Mm. She's like okay. a who. All right. So we do have three guys left. I know you were <laughs> the last one. I'm so sorry. Right, okay. <laughs> <laughs> but I am going to go ahead and have you ask these guys a question just to help you narrow it down. See who's more of your match. Okay. Um, are you faithful right now? And if you are, what is your faith in? Okay. Let's start right here with your name and age and the answer. She kind of look like tiny or something. I'm Cedric. I'm 31. Um, I'm a Christian. I don't go to church like that, but I will, you know I do. I'm like I think I love like the church, church sometimes, like in Chandler. Um, but yeah, like more than that, I'm a Christian though. Uh, I go to church when I can. Okay. Okay. Let's go over here with your name and age and the answer to her question. I'm Trey. I'm 29. Um, I don't really have a religion i just believe in god at the end of the day but as far as going to church i haven't been in a while but i just believe in god i don't have i don't clarify you, got, you, know, you come, you no come up to meek and weak and self and name and age and the answer to her question um timothy 37 as well as him uh I claim christianity um, I claim i used to go to a non-denominational non-denominational church okay. uh used to sing in praise and worship uh, um, oh lord you know he, he in the choir and that's that's what i claim Tambourine player. All right. Let's head on back. Let's head on back. Okay. okay. I am going to have you pop one of these guys' balloons. Just kind of based off of what you've heard, what you yeah, see. Yeah, this got to be the last call for alcohol. This, I ain't never seen a group this low. This. There you go. And then just whenever you're ready. They just put this like a throwaway episode. This got to be something just for the street show. All right. So why did we end up popping his? Um, I just think... Bitch, here, come in here like today. We still one. If I had met you, I don't think that I would have, like, you would have been my type off rip. Okay. Is there anything specific? Um, no, I just don't think it's something I would normally go for immediately. I don't know. Okay. She ain't leaving none of these dudes. Now, is she someone that's your type? Uh, no. Um, but I would, I wanted to hear you out. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm somewhat oh, attracted to you, but it's just, I was just trying to get some more information to see. Where I could fit in, possibly. Who the hell? I need to see and, the uh, top of that shoulder. I guess. That motherfucker hustling. Today's not a good day today. <laughs> Today's definitely not a good day today. I'm not happy right now. Oh. <laughs> I'm not happy right now. Uh, why aren't you happy right now? Uh, my balloon got popped. That's why. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> like, not happy right now. It's okay, though. Sorry, Timothy. Yeah. <laughs> Let's head on back. He struck out a lot of holes all right, today, I mean, man. Ask these remaining guys another question. Okay. Um, kids, do you guys have any? If so, how many? Okay, start over here. Any kids? I got one. She's seven. Do you want more? Um, yes. Okay. Down the line one day, hopefully. Okay. Okay. And over here, any kids? No, none. No, none. And do you want some? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Now for yourself, do you have any kids? Yeah, so I have one son. He's seven. Um, but I don't want any more. You don't want any more. Mm -hmm. Okay. So let's go on over here. Yeah, yeah. So obviously you end up popping on the kids. You don't like no so kids, do we? That is your type, though, before that? Yes. Okay. okay. What makes her your type? Uh, she's physically attractive. I mean, I think she's goal-driven. Um, other than that, hearing what she last said, that she didn't want any more, mm -hmm. would definitely would have been the kill to it. Right, right. Okay. So is he someone that's your type? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And what makes him your type? Um, I feel like his stature, um, his physical appearance is very attractive. You have really nice features. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Y'all trying, so trying to breathe? Have you can't breathe left, left, any questions between the two of you? Like she um, yes, uh, what's your idea of first date? My idea of a first date? Yeah. Um, You'll never know. I'm a foodie, so I like to try different things. I like to go for an experience, too. So okay. um, something with a little bit of a mix. New food or something like that with a nice like. This would be a match. Aesthetic. Okay. Mm -hmm. Makes sense. Okay. All right. But he heavy. Well, he might get a girl. We'll bring you on up. We never know. We never know. Let's see here. So, any final but questions? He awkward. You before we determine if this is a match. Uh, yes. Uh, like you travel a lot. Like. Kind of. So I travel a little bit. Most of the time for work is okay. where I travel a lot. And when it's not for work, I do like to travel um, in my free time or just to have fun. So, yeah. yeah. Okay. So same. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. I'm about the same. Okay. okay. <laughs> You're about the same. All right. So my final question is, is it going to be a match for you for her? Yes. 
Okay. And is it a match for you for him? Uh, no. Okay. No. <laughs> I but knew it. Only because um, I wouldn't want to deprive you of anything, like having more kids or whatever like that. Oh, yeah, nah, and I'm real. just not on that right now. Oh, nah, for real. Mm-hmm. Okay. I ain't going to let it. You ain't shit, yeah. shorty. Oh. Yeah, head back over there. Thank you. Oh. All right. Well, that is all the balloons popped. We do thank you so much for coming on. Let's go ahead and give it up for her, guys. I'll thank take you. this. Thank you so much. She's like, nah. Mm-mm. I tell you, man, this is a little group, man. Thank you, everyone, for tuning into this episode. The, the last of Pop the three Bull- soldiers, man. That's them right there, man. Y'all see how it went down, man. Yo, that's crazy. This is one of them episodes, man. This is one of them, them throwaway episodes, I think, man. It's like. I'm judging people, so I'm looking at the group. wasn't the great group. The the people that had to come on, wasn't the great people to come on. It was like, mm, it was only like, it wasn't even an hour. It was what, 53 minutes, 54 minutes, something like that, man. Y'all know how we get down, though, man. We do this every time they come out, man. This has been Pop the Balloon to Find Love, episode 24. See us next time, man. We're going to do it again. I, I do go live on the channel every Friday at 9 p.m., though, talking about stuff just like this, man. Hit that like button, the comment button, the share button, the subscribe button, the notification bell. All them good buttons you got to hit to get this pimping that I'm putting out when I put it out. Like I said, I do go live every Friday at 9 p.m. Come through, join the conversation, and holler at your boy, Heist Man the Foe. Talk that talk, ghetto news and opinion. This is a dangerous group that groups that we're dealing with now. All right. This time, but I'll be back and sooner than you think. Wherever there's prejudice, ignorance, inequality, I'll be there.